Hi and welcome in my another Photoshop tutorial guys. Today I prepare for you eye retouch tutorial. It's basic tutorial but I think it's very important for example in portrait retouch. So I hope it will be helpful for you. As you see our eyes not always look perfect because sometimes we have these small vines on the eyeball. So at first we need to remove these unnecessary parts from our eye and then I show you how to make color correction on the eye and stuff like this, how to increase the colors, increase the shine of the eye. As I said, at first we remove this small vine, so I duplicate my background layer. As you see now we can see those things better and it's a few methods to remove these vines and I show you two for me best method to do this the first method is put herring brush tool just click and drag a little and as you see the veins uh, are removing so it's a perfect tool to do uh, something like this maybe even the best tool but also it's another tool even maybe better I'm not sure and it's called patch tool so for so for this type of retouch I use only spoot heading brush tool and patch tool Take a look how works patch tool. You need to make selection on the parts what you wanna remove, just like me. And then move these parts a little, for example here. And take a look, click right and deselect and as you see, we really remove this unnecessary part. Uh, so it works perfect for me. And again, it takes me a while, so be patient and probably I make this part uh, faster. Of course we didn't need to remove everything because we want to keep natural look so uh, it's normal. So okay, take a look. I think now it's uh, much better than before, as you see. So, okay, now we remove the vein, so I change this uh, layer name I should do this uh, before but okay as you see her veins are removed so now it's time to increase the iris of the eye increase the colors at first we need to make selection I use elliptical margi tool and feather at 5 pixels is okay 
So we need to select all the iris. So I started right here, I think. And take a look. Something like this. Then go to Hue Saturation and I put saturation about 30. And as you see, the color are better. You can add more, even 30 if you want, but it doesn't look natural then. And now you can make some color correction. So press Ctrl or Command on Mac and click on this Hue Saturation layer. Then you can go to color balance on or, or levers, for example, whatever you want. I prefer color balance for this. And take a look, you can change the eye color a little. I don't want to um, increase the color too much because uh, it doesn't be natural. And as I said, the natural look is very important. So, okay, I think it's enough. Uh, as you see, the edges doesn't look uh, nice right now, so you can go to Filter, Blur and Gaussian Blur to make it a little blurry. For example, 25 pixels is okay. And at the end, uh, the last tool you can use to increase the eye to make eye retouch is Dutch tool. So create new layer, fill this layer with color gray, click edit, fill and use 50% gray. Then change blend mode to overlay to make this layer invisible. And then I use range mid tones and exposure at 30% is perfect for me. And then paint with Dutch. Uh, tool on your eye. As you see, it works perfect. But don't put uh, too much uh, Dutch tool. Uh, as I said uh, before, because uh, then you can destroy your image. Some reflection maybe And okay, I think it's enough. Take a look. That was our eye before retouch. And that's how it looks right now. So I think now it looks much better. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Thank you for watching. My name is Marcin and see you in the next Photoshop tutorial.